Hello, everyone, and welcome to this week's high school basketball power rankings. Remember, our rankings are based on team performance within their classification. And we start with the girls, 10 through 6. At number 10 is Bernie Champion, number 9, Fredericksburg, number 8, Smithson Valley, number 7 is Steele, number 6 is O'Connor. Now to the top five. At number five is Clark. The Cougars had a dramatic 42 to 40 win over number six O'Connor on Tuesday and are now two wins away from an outright district championship starting with Holmes on Saturday. At number four is Brandeis. The Broncos have won five straight and will be favorites to win their last two games against Jay and Taft. At number three is Veterans Memorial. The Patriots lost a dramatic 55 to 51 game in Kerrville on Tuesday night in front of a hostile and sold out gym. Veterans Memorial finishes out district play at home on Friday against Wagner. At number two is Kerrville Tyvee. The Antlers got the big win over number three, Veterans Memorial, on Tuesday night to sweep the Patriots and claim the district championship. Don't be surprised to see these two teams square off for the regional championship in about a month. And number one is Judson. It's been a great season for the Rockets. Coach Treva Corrales picked up her 300th win earlier this season. And senior Kyra White just surpassed the 1,500 point total for her career. Judson has a chance to go undefeated in a strong district if they can win the last two starting tomorrow night against number eight, Smithson Valley. And now to the boys' rankings. At number 10 is Pleasanton. The Eagles enter our poll as a state-ranked 4A team who are undefeated in District 34A. Pleasanton will be big favorites against Gonzalez tomorrow night before a big showdown with district title implications at Lavernia on Tuesday. At number nine is still the Knights drop in our poll, but bounce back after a loss to Clemens with a 28-point win over San Marcos on Tuesday night. At number eight is Clemens. After a 10-point win over Steel last Friday, the Buffaloes appeared to have had a letdown on Tuesday night in a loss to New Braunfels Canyon to fall back into a first-place tie with Steel for the district lead. Clemens is at San Marcos on Friday night. At number seven is Randolph. The Rohawks move up in our poll after avenging their only loss of the season when they beat the Cole Cougars 68-65 to on Tuesday night. Randolph, Cole, and Marion are all in the top 10 in Class uh, 3A in the state rankings and are all in the same district. At number six is Alamo Heights. The Mules have a two-game lead for first place in district and can take a huge step towards a district title if they can beat a strong second place Brackenridge team at the Mule Dome on Friday night. At number five is Johnson. The Jaguars are tied for the district lead with Roosevelt, but own the head-to-head -head matchup with the Rough Riders in district play. At number four, St. Mary's Hall. The Barons have now won nine straight and are undefeated in district play. The Barons have a chance to stand alone in first place if they can beat Antonian on Friday night at home. At number three is Antonian, and the Apaches beat St. Mary's Hall in the championship game of the SAISD tournament back in early December. That was the last time that the Barons lost. At number two is Brennan. The Barons were one of the hottest teams in the city, winning eight straight and have sole possession of first place in District 28-6A. Brennan can take a complete command of the district race if they can beat second place O'Connor on Friday night. And of course, the Panthers handed the Brennan Bears their only district loss. And number one again is Wagner. In a season where there doesn't seem to be many dominant teams in San Antonio, the Wagner Thunderbirds stand alone. The T-Birds are destroying the competition and are now 12-0 in district play. And after a week off, Wagner is back in action at home against JISD rival Veterans Memorial this Friday night. Be sure to check out some of the area's best high school basketball action on TSRNSports.com and the TSRN Sports mobile app. And that is this week's high school basketball power rankings. We will see you again next Thursday night. Brought to you by Mattress and Furniture for Less. Quality furniture, incredible prices. Plus, buy it today and get it today. Now with three San Antonio locations.